Hi, hello everyone. Today we are going to see how to do NDVI using Landsat 5 TM data. So this is my satellite image as you can see here. Uh, this is having six bands, three, two, one. This is a uh, watch color composite. So we go to raster. From there we are going to indices. So as you can see, uh, from indices we are going to obtain the NDVI that is normal normalized difference vegetation index. So this has been already selected. This is land uh, land side. So as you can see, the two important uh, bands used in this NDVI is uh, near infrared and red. By this we will be obtaining our NDVI results. Just. Uh, We'll go and uh, review the result. So, this is my uh, NDVI result. I'm just previewing it. As you can see, the darker colors are not; they are not uh, vegetations and the light colors represent vegetations the dark color has been suppressed and uh, where the vegetation is it's been uh, brightened or highlighted so now we go back there I'm going to close this the next thing is view. so this is a spatial modeler this is how our uh, process works this is our satellite image this is our satellite image this is band 1 and band 2 from there we will be obtaining our output how this work uh, it's, uh, it's based on a formula that is band NIR minus visible divided by NIR plus visible so this uh, near infrared and uh, visible spectrum differs from uh, one satellite to another satellite that is uh, in Landsat A there is a different uh, different uh, sequence and in uh, Landsat 4 it's a different sequence so first of all we need to identify which is uh, which sensor is uh, near infrared and which sensor is visible that is red so I'm going to close it I'm going to give my output location. Okay. NDVI. So I'm just going to save it. Um, okay. So it's been processed. So it's been work working out for the results. So this may be taking uh, just a uh, seconds. Sometimes it takes a minute to just a minute close. It. So as you can see, this is my result. This is my NDVI, and uh, this is my satellite data. You can see closely the vegetation is being. Uh, the vegetation is being given a light light color and uh, the water bodies and other uh, land area which has been uh, uh, given uh, darker colors and uh, you can see a uh, different shades in uh, uh, in the both uh, bright and dark that represents the how much density is been the vegetation found on a land surface so this is my result I'm going to show you in this show you this result in uh, ArcGIS so as you can see here now I have uh, classified this I have uh, obtained that uh, NDVI result from that ADAS and I have put it into this ArcGIS and I have classified it into 5 classes uh, likely high to very low so thank you for watching my video keep supporting